Keep so we won't be able to save Pokemon. <laughs> Fine, take your stupid skull. So the dream our king had, the dream we had, didn't come true. How are you holding up, fellow subject of our king? Gorm of the Seven Sages. I'm mortified this skull, which we went through the trouble to obtain, was stolen from us so easily. That is not important. We can afford to abandon the Dragon Skull. According to the results of our research, this is not the legendary Pokemon for which Team Plasma is looking. No shit, it's a Dragonite! It's completely unrelated. But we will not allow anyone to disrupt our plans and get away with it. We will fix it so that you never interfere with us again. Is that a threat? Oh, sweet! The bug Pokemon were getting all worked up, so here I come. And what do I spy with my little eye? This important looking guy. Are you here to help your friend, whom I defeated? Trelly! Burr! Others didn't have anything. Who are you supposed to be? Is this guy the big boss? I am one of the seven sages of Team Plasma. Getsis, another of the seven sages, will liberate Pokemon with words alone. <clears throat> the remainder of the seven sages have ordered their compatriots to take Pokemon with full force. But the odds are a little against us now. To you, the bug Pokemon user, not Berg, and not normal per Pokemon user, not Lenora, I say, know your enemies, know yourself, and you need not fear the result of a hundred battles. This time, I shall retreat quietly. To secure the liberation of Pokemon, we will steal Pokemon from trainers. Even though you are gym leaders, we do not tolerate any further obstruction from you. In any case, we will settle this someday. I hope you are looking forward to that time as much as I. <laughs> there, Speedy Bunch. <clears throat> what do you plan to do, Burke? Are you gonna chase him? Hmm. Well, we got back the stolen skull, and if we corner them, there's no telling what they might do. I think I'll be heading back. Well, now. I'll be waiting for your challenge at the Castilla City Pokemon Gym. Yes, indeed. I'm certainly looking forward to it. You're holding that Dragon Skull so you worked so hard to get back, right? Yup. Thank you so much. With a kind trainer like you taking care of them, the Pokemon with you must be happy. Take this as a token of my gratitude. Use it carefully. Yay. I still don't have anything to use a Moonstone on. Isn't it the second Moonstone I've gotten in this run? At least, right? Yeah. Got one in the Dream Yard. Hey, Trap. Uh, you just missed me ruffle stomping the Team Plasma guys and catching a ferret. Oh, great. really wish I had a better move set on Pixel. But at least I don't have Hyper Beam this time. The move that I used so cockily that it caused him to die last time he was in the party. Of course that happened. Give him a thunder punch. Kinda wish I still had my Oshawott. Oh shit! Swaddle. Yeah, let's uh... Let's get Pixel out of there.
guard split. And that's actually gonna help him. Her. Whatever. It. Why do they do that? Half grass type. What are you doing? Oh, another thing. I also found an Eviolite. -like. Attack order makes sense from Zawaddle. Not a whole lot of sense, but it makes it. Fucking stealing part of my Eviolite bonus. Uh, yeah, a lot of things on uh, a lot of my Pokemon would be nice. Uh, sure, go ahead. Oh, look. Drooper gon' die. Drooper gon' die. Oh, look. Drooper died. Like a bitch. Oh, God. What's this? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Son of a bitch, I just want to get to the fucking healer. Fucking Christ, let me go. <sighs> Thanks, game, for continually <laughs> reminding me of allies past. Bushroot looks like my best bet here. Tail? You gotta be kidding me. <sighs> I don't even. Can I please get back to the outskirts of the forest? Thank you! That was obnoxious. Those are fights that Pixel could have fought if he was healthy. Now, were those subtitles what were actually said there, or... not? That's fucked up either way. Though, you know, not entirely unbelievable from anime. Especially some of the weird ones out there. Okay. I know I can get to that item ball. I just gotta... An oval stone. Yeah... Even if Happini was an option for the party, I wouldn't want to use it. Can I come back in here? Oh, no, I can't. Cause, yeah, because the dark grass here in Pinwheel Forest is fucking like level 30. Alright. During the two minutes that it's going to take to go cross Sky Arrow Bridge, I gotta ask. Should I go fill out the rest of my party on Route 4? Or should I... have actually just stayed in Pinwheel Forest to grind to 20? Because 20 is the all the higher I'm going for Castelia Gym. And then I'll probably only go to 25 for Nimbasa. Because I don't want to be too high a level. Even though I failed last time and I was, like, on par. 
<laughs> Though to be fair, I failed last time at the league at the level that I usually grind to the league for. I have space for one more. Might as well. I know I've got a Firestone. Do I have a Thunderstone yet? Or a Leaf Stone? Negative. I guess it was Waterstone and Leaf Stone. I was going to talk to the guy with the, uh, the monkeys. I forget, what do I have to do? I know there's the dancing guys that I can fight. Wow. If my cursor was visible, I'd, uh, be like, I'd show what's up with the, uh, missing geometry there. Try to go in the gym, thank you. I just challenged Jim Weeder Berg. <laughs> He's a seasoned gym leader. You made me work hard for that gym badge. But for me, bug type Pokemon aren't much of a challenge. Let me keep winning against all you know of the gym leaders. Then I'll head for the Pokemon League and I'll perform the champion. Even if I do that, everyone will admit <laughs> what a strong trainer I am. That'll make me feel truly alive. Vain much? What the fuck? Aha! You're the one who fought Team Plasma in Pinwheel Forest. If I remember, your name's Trellier. Come to challenge the gym, I suppose. Ah, oh, sorry, but you're gonna have to wait a bit. I was informed that Team Plasma shown up. In fact, come with me. I'm gonna go to the dock. Uh, the Prime Pier. I can speak. I can read. I swear. Sorry, wanted to check something. I think Prime Pier is this one. Negative, it's the next one. <laughs> uh, come on, this way. Team Plasma, they took this young lady's Pokemon. My mana! <laughs> that you don't have. I heard this lady scream and I ran all this way as fast as I could. But the city's so big and crowded, I'm afraid I lost them. Iris. Not Iris. <laughs> did you. Did, you did everything you could. But it's so bad. Taking people's Pokemon is really bad. Because it's really nice to people when, when Pokemon people get together. They each have each other. <laughs> they each have something the other doesn't, and they help each other. No fear, we will get Pokemon back, right? Bah, bah. It's really not that confusing. I spy a gym leader. Last time went so well, I thought I'd grab another Pokemon. Rethinking? I need to get out of here. Let's go. Iris, you stay by that young lady's side. Zoom! Totally not Iris. Alright. I believe we are going back. Oh, damn. Look at the geometry on that building. Wow, half the polygons don't even show up on it. At least not from certain angles. Eh. Whatever. The idea is the same. Something tells me I shouldn't have Pixel in the lead right now. Just for the simple fact that uh, he's about to hit level 20. And I think there's two or three fights here. I actually don't remember. I don't pay that close attention to the Team Plasma fights. Psyduck. Glad I didn't go for reversal, because that would have sucked. 
The mirror move actually makes sense for Psyduck. As weird as that is. Just in case this guy's got Mimic or something. Oh, no you don't. Air Slash, huh? Shouldn't Smelling Salt be a fighting move? Just saying. Oh, it is the emulator. This emulation is not perfect. I'm going in! There's no combat here, I believe. So, yeah, I think it was just the one fight. So I was getting all uppity for nothing. My word, if it isn't the gym leader, not Berg. So, what would you say is the guiding principle of Team Plasma, anyway? Take what you want from people? I thought it would be amusing to prepare a hideout right in front of a Pokemon gym, but we detected we were detected more quickly than I imagined. Indeed, no matter. We already have exceptional base of operations. Is everyone familiar with the legend of the foundings of the Unova region? I am. It's the Black Dragon, right? The truth is... The Black Dragon appeared before a hero who sought the ideal way to knit together a world of warring people. This Black Dragon-type Pokémon shared its knowledge and bared its fangs at those who stood against it. Together, the power of this Pokémon and the hero brought unity to the hearts of everyone in the land. And that is how Unova was created. We shall bring back the hero that and that Pokemon to Unova once again. If we can win people's hearts and minds, we can easily create a world that I, I mean Team Plasma, desires. Here at Castilia, we have a lot of different kinds of people. Everyone's ways of thinking and lifestyles are very different. Honestly, I think there's something you're, you're saying that I don't quite understand. One thing is, we all have one thing we all have in common is that we care a lot about Pokemon. Even people meeting the, for the first time can talk about Pokemon. Talk, or battle, or trade. Remember your speech in Town? You were responsible for leading me to rethink my relationship with Pokemon. And for that, I thank you. At that time, I made a promise. I swore to myself that I would dedicate myself to Pokemon even more strongly. And what you guys are doing? Aren't you... <clears throat> Aren't you going to strengthen the bond between people and Pokemon even more? <laughs> you are quite hard to figure out. A little more intelligent than I'd expect. I'm fond of intelligent people, you see? You'll enjoy hearing about this. From every corner of the world, I have gathered knowledgeable people for our king's benefit. You could call them the Seven Sages. Very well. We will submit to your opinion and be on our way. That girl over there, return her Pokemon. Blah, 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 I don't care, it's a mana that she doesn't have. The friendship between Pokemon and people can be very touching. But, in order to liberate Pokemon from foolish people, we will revive the legend of Unova and win the hearts and minds of everyone. Farewell! What are you doing? Why are you letting him get away? Uh, what do we do if, it, <clears throat> if anything's happened to the other Pokemon that got stolen? It's okay, I thank you, Iris. No one was hurt more than anything, I got my darling Pokemon back! <laughs> Okay, if you're happy. What's everyone planning to do now? Oh, it would be sensational to look around Castilia City, but... 
Don't worry. I'll keep being your bodyguard. Uh huh. That's great. Not Iris is a dazzling Pokemon trainer, but she may not be, maybe not in the home big city yet. So a little give and take. Hmm. People in Pokemon need to help each other out. Thanks for looking out for the Pokemon. Here, this is for you. A Yachi Berry. Great. See ya. Well then, Joe. I'll be waiting at the gym. And smoke ball. Fitting. Was that supposed to be a smoke ball? Because if that wasn't, that'd be a weird coincidence. That just breaks my brain. I think there's a couple trainers in one of these buildings that I can fight. Yeah, it's this building. Because they're totally not janitor. Uh, I actually think there's a uh, battle with Bianca before I leave town. Actually, no, that's um, a battle with um, Charon, and that's out on the route. So, yeah, I might as well. What the hell? That'll give me a little more wiggle room to... To fight these battles here in town, so. Oh, that vending machine's actually kind of tempting to just sit and spend a lot of money at. Because I could really use some healing items, and lemonade is the best thing available right now. Ooh, nice! Max Revive! Oh, really? You got a fucking Metapod? It's a waste. It's a waste. It's a waste. It's a waste. It's not a total waste because I do have a full moveset with it, so. Uh, not currently. His steel hard shell protects his tender body. It quietly endures the hardships while awaiting evolution. Where did everyone go? <sighs> snack a drink while I'm waiting. Pincer Chow? No. Push Cubs and Shove, I'll make a reference to um, my brother's yellow version file from like almost 20 years ago. <laughs> it's gonna be. It's gonna be a Butterfree in a level, so I'm not gonna call it Meta Pod. If anything, I'll just call it Winner. <laughs> because. Fucking Gen 1 Metapod was. Well, Gen 1 Butterfree was broken. That's how he had it nicknamed, so. <laughs> there we go. 
Reference to Justin's fucking uh, Butterfree. Oh, what's it got? It's Rash Nature with a big root. Glare, Skull Bash, Ice Shard, Light Scream. It's supposed to have Shield Dust right now, isn't it? Not gonna lie, that's kinda shitty. Hmm. Well, it's rash nature, I'm gonna give it Doom Desire. Um Glare's useful. Skull Bash really isn't. Kinda wish I had more TMs than this. Uh, let's use one of my potions here. Uh, I've got a couple more trainers to fight, and then it'll be grinding time. Hang on. I want to look at winner's stats real quick. Uh, maybe looking at them as a metapod's a bad idea. Because its stats do change quite a bit once it becomes butterfree. I think a special attack takes off. So Doom Desire is a good idea. And there's no guarantee that um, it'll keep compatibility with it. So. Wow, they didn't do shit. <laughs> 